I'm working here on an elevation view and what I want to do, let me just zoom in a little, is to draw some sort of clumping shrubbery as a low growing almost ground cover plant through this area. I've drawn a polyline and you can see when I click on it I haven't put very many vertices in and I've got another line under here which ostensibly joins to the polyline or in fact does join. What I want to show you is that if I select that upper polyline and apply curve fitting to it, and that's now been done, so I've got a more organic shape. At that point, and I select that line there, and I select the bottom line, so I'm trying to join a polyline to a line and right click and select join, can't join objects. The reason for that is the curve fitting. So if you want to do the sort of thing that I'm aiming for here, what you would do is select that line, take off any curve fitting, and now we have a polyline and a line without any editing that's pre-applied, and now I should be able to join it. Now I can pick the polyline and apply the curve fitting subsequent to it, and I get uh, my ground cover. Now at this point you can tweak things by dragging and down like so to get the sort of organic shape that you might well be after. I guess the lesson is to put a fair number of control points in if you're trying to do that sort of thing. But we're able now to say, yeah, oh, I'd like that filled and goes in. And then if we select it again and I pick color, we can pick, say, any one of these others. Let's imagine sort of a gray salt fishy type plant and we put it in the foreground um, with the other taller shrubbery behinds. So it's just an illustration that just be a little careful with the join command.